What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield and ladies and gentlemen, we got ourselves a banger of a video today. We got ourselves a Zygarde team. Yes, you guys heard that correctly, a Zygarde team. Now that Series 8 is about to come on its way, we are going to be showing off some new teams. And if you guys do not know what Series 8 is, it allows one restricted Pokemon per team. So it's not February 1st yet, which means Season 8 is not, or Series 8 is not allowed yet. But I wanted to get you guys a team before Series 8 does start. So this is the team I want to get out here. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to tune with all things Series 8. We're going to be trying to show off most of the restricted Pokemon on all different teams. But this team right here was sent in by my boy Azback. Azback, you rock. Thank you so much for dropping this team. If you guys want to leave me Series 8 team, head in the link in the description below. Jeans underscore YouTube. It's the link to my Instagram page. DM me over there with Series 8 teams. And chances are I will probably use them because I'm going to need them for videos but rocking out on this team front spot we got Zygarde the heart and soul of this team we got power construct as its ability weakness policy is dragon and ground type with outrage thousand arrows iron tail for coverage and protect I cannot wait to dominate with him we got real boom right next to him you guys know plenty about it fake out brick break grassy guide and protect with that grassy surge and miracle seed Rotom's behind the face cam with levitate and safety goggles overheat thunderbolt nasty plot and protect we also got earth food with that focus ash gotta have that focus ash on that pokemon the fighting and dark type with wicked blow close combat sucker punch and detect a fairly normal move set for that pokemon bottom left corner we got ourselves an ultra beast on this team with celestia a soul fest beast boost ability flash cannon for stab air slash for stab then we got meteor beam and flamethrower both as our coverage moves then in the final spot is our support mom with Confia. i absolutely love this pokemon try his ability but beery berry for their steel moves and then we got draining kiss floral healing alice switch and protect and we can actually oh, actually blah, 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 can't speak right now we can actually proc weakness policy for that zygarde and get buzzing from there guys if you want to try out the scene for yourself rental code is at the bottom of the screen but let's get after it with this zygarde team Let's get rolling with this Zygarde team. I cannot wait to show it off. I seriously think this Pokemon is going to be an absolute beast in Series 8 due to its ability. So when it drops below half HP, it changes forms, gets a massive base HP boost, and his stats go crazy. This thing's an absolute monster. But first battle going up against a Drought team. This guy's got Torkoal, Venusaur, Glacier. He also has Trick Room and all that good stuff. I kind of want to roll out with uh, Zygarde and Comfy to get Buzznear. I kind of like that a lot. I'm gonna bring Urshfu in the back end and then in the final spot, probably Rotom Heat. Kind of covers a lot of these guys. He also has Tailwind, he has all these different things. He can taunt me, which I don't really like. Actually, I don't really mind if he taunts my Confi. Because I can still go into a Draining Kiss and roll from there. And if he goes for that uh, Trick Room Mon, I can absolutely dump on that with a Weakness Policy Zygarde. So I'm liking that. I'm liking this team. I'm liking it a lot. But yo, we got a bunch of Series 8 teams ready to go, getting rolling for you guys. We got ourselves a Palkia team on the way. Dialga team, Rayquaza, Yavelta, Exernius. Uh, who else we have? We have Reshiram. I know we have a couple other ones. More Kyogre, Groudon. We got everything ready for Series 8. So I cannot wait to show off all these teams for you guys. It's going to be hype. Hopefully you guys do enjoy. Make sure you smash that like button if you guys do. And subscribe if you're not subscribed already. But Torkoal and Venus, we're going to get popping here. He's going to Drought. He's going to get the Drought one. And I think I just Dynamax uh, Draining Kiss and roll from there. Take out the Torkoal with a Max Quake. Get the uh, Special Defense boost going. Is that the play? Is that the play? I think it might be the play. Do a Thousand Arrows. Thousand Arrows is such a cool move. You guys do not know what this thing does. Look at it. This move also hits opposing Pokemon that are in the air. So it's a ground move that hits Pokemon in the air. And then it knocks them down to the ground. That is phenomenal. That is phenomenal. I am going to Quake over here. I am going to Dynamax. And I think I am going to go for a Draining Kiss and Proc Policy. Right? Is that the play? Yes. I believe it is the play. I believe it is the play. And I don't think uh, what's called is any moves that are going to uh, take us out. Right? That Venusaur? No, and I do have Ally Switch on my uh, on my Compi for next turn. So he is going to uh, Dynamax the Venusaur. If you're not using Series 8 teams in casual, just go play rank. I, mean, I don't know what you're doing. Like, the meta's changing, so it's either you're practicing with Series 8 teams or you're playing on the rank ladder. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> I just don't get it. Hopefully, we can uh, buzz with this team today. Hoping to just get some wins and all that. Maybe go 3 0, maybe capture a 3 0 or 2 1. Get buzzing with these guys. But Zygarde's so cool. Such a cool Pokemon, especially his ability. I cannot wait to show it off if you guys haven't seen it before. 414 HP, that's nothing compared to when he power control. It's awesome. Let's see what happens here. Torkoal's going to protect. Mm -mm. Buttered biscuit. 
It's all right. We're gonna get a special defense boost, and I am going to be able to. Uh, I am going to be able to uh, ally switch next turn, depending on what he does here. I could floral heal. I could do a lot here. Let's see what he does. I'm gonna go for the vine lash over onto his Zygarde. That's easy. I'm just gonna floral healing him. Then. I am just gonna floral healing him up. We have a policy. Get him. Let's get after it. Yo. Get him. Built. Still doing a heap of amount of damage. We love to see that. Okay. But yeah, I definitely think floral healing is to play. Instead of taking out my. Uh... Now, is he gonna swap? Does he have a flying Pokemon on him? No, oh, Comfy taking some damage. Yo, chill on me. Fine Lash doing a sip. Bring us below here. Bring us below here. Oh my lord, I wish I would have done it. I wish I would have done it. I am gonna floral he heal him up. Or I could ally switch and just get that boost. Let me see uh, what Pokemon he's rocking. Do you have any flying types that can come in here? No. So we are safe to go into yet another Max Quake over onto the slot. And then I just floral heal. And then I just floral heal over onto my side guard. Give him some more HP. Have him a bit more bulkier. And wait for him just to change his, uh, his ability to proc. There you go, floral healing. Here you go, buddy. Here you go, buddy. Take some HP back. That's lovely. That's lovely. Vine Lash gonna come in here. Over on Zygarde again. God, yes. There you go. Hit Zygarde. That's fun. Floral healing kind of just counteracts that a lot. So here goes my Quake. We have the uh, special defense up again. Torkoal's gone. That's a huge turn for us. I can just floral heal again, but I really want my HP to drop. So I might just ally switch here and have Vine Lash uh, swap us. And do some mean damage over onto this Venus slot. Torkoal done. Zygarde just makes people quit nowadays. Zygarde just makes people quit. <laughs> we were just about to set up our Zygarde in that first battle, but that guy either quit or disconnected, but it's all good. We're going to be trying to show him off here in battle number two. This guy's got a, uh, I forget what that Pokemon's called. It's the Moon Legendary from Pokemon Moon. I forget what it's called, but that's his Legendary of choice. He also has Zamazetta, but I still want to set up uh, my Zygarde, get buzzing with that. I totally forget what that Pokemon's called, but he's very, very cool. I had Pokemon Moon over Sun. That was my choice. That was my choice. Let me know in the comment section down below. Did you guys go with Pokemon Moon or Pokemon Sun? I was a Moon guy. I was a Moon guy. Um, I think I'm going to go Urshifu here as well. And actually, Rillaboom's kind of looking pretty nice here too. Rillaboom and Urshifu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's try to get buzzing with the Zygarde squad. But yeah, that last battle, we were, we were just about to get set up. We were just like this close to being there. To just fully, absolutely sweeping with this team. Hopefully we can get it here, set off that power construct and buzz from there. Because he is so good. And his move's so cool, his Thousand Arrows move. I love it, considering you can just knock down uh, flying Pokemon or levitate Pokemon. It's awesome. He's going to go with Spooky and Urshifu. And Spooky is the Mimikyu. The Mimi Mimikyu. Okay. And uh, do I let him proc my policy here? I think I let him proc my policy here. Alright, Dynamax and I just Steel Spike. And I just drain and kiss to take off that ally switch. Well, not ally switch. To take off the, uh, the disguise. And try to get rid of this thing. I think that's a play. I think that's a move. We're not going to uh, proc our policy. Because I think Mimikyu's going to do it. I really do think Mimikyu is going to do it. So we're just going to get after it with a steel spike. And we're going to take off the disguise. Because one steel spike should be able to take this thing out. If it doesn't Dynamax. Even though it's coverage move. I still feel like it takes him out. We got a big HP boost. For 414. Power construct if we can get that rolling. Slam it. Give me slam it. Dragon Kiss gonna come out here. Give me that disguise, baby. That's all mine. Oh, right. give me that. Later, spooky disguise. Plan is getting rolling here. And he might take out, out my uh, what's it called? I don't like one bit. Oh, we do go before. We do go before, which is huge. So we outspeed both. There's my steel spike. This is KO, right? Yes, it does. Beautiful. And we get a defensive boost up against Urshu. Yeah, love to see it. So I could proc policy next turn for me. Which I might just do. Which I might just do. Depending on uh, how everything goes here. He's gonna go into a... A Surgeon Strikes. Oh, this is a Water Urshifu. That's fine. Go ahead. Get after my confidence. Wow. No, we eat. We eat with that defense boost. That defense boost is huge. Awesome defense boost there. And I am going to proc my policy. And I'm pretty sure we can just sweep this battle. I want him to bring me under half so I can draw <laughs> power control. But Zygarde just too good. He's too good, man. I think we're just going to sweep this one. Zamazetta is going to come out here. But I am totally proccing policy. I'm getting after that thing. He is going to get a defense boost. We are defense boosted as well. But we are going to get an attack boost. 
Oh, I'm just going to quake up against that thing. It's special defense, please. I'm just gonna drain and kiss it over here. And roll I'm not really worried about that Urshifu now that we have the defense boost. This Confi it was able to eat up all day. Drain and kiss. Mwah. Give me that policy proc. So now we're setting up. We're setting up just well. So step step one's done with the pro with the weakness policy proc. If he can bring me below half HP, we're gonna be sitting so good. I think he might Dynamax. Or I don't think he can Dynamax him. Oh, you're gonna go for a Behemoth Bash and we're gonna eat this? Thank you, Baviri Berry. Thank you, Babiri Berry. Give it up. And we got a defense boost as well. We got a defense boost as well. Built. No. Mmm. Tasty, baby. Easy eats. Zombies is probably gonna go down here. Babiri Berry clutching up. Here goes our Quake. Get him. Get after it, baby. I love how he's part ground, too. I love that typing on him. Dragon and ground. Zombies that up. Out my face. Zygarde OP, baby. Dude, this thing's gonna be so strong in Series 8. I cannot wait to see what other Pokemon are going to be absolutely monsters in it. The Zygarde's Beast. I think Rayquaza is going to be pretty cool to use. I think uh, Xerneas, the, the legendary from X and Y, he's going to be a beast. This guy's just started striking. I think he's up banded into it now. That's fine. We got the defense boost. But I want him to bring me down. I might hit my own Zygarde on purpose just to do damage to me. So his next Pokemon is probably going to be his Dynamax Pokemon. It's got to be, right? 100%. Gotta be his Dynamax, but Inteleon. So Inteleon is gonna come out here. Hopefully he gets after me. He should be able to outspeed me. And honestly, I could. I am gonna go here. I could Floral Heal. I could Ally Switch. But I think this thing's gonna be Pilot or Dash, so I might just double into it. But I want, I don't wanna, like, if this was a ranked game, I would totally Ally Switch here. Keep my Zygarde just up and going. But I want him to hit him and do work on him. I want him to power construct him. I want him to power construct. There you go, Dynamax. We are going to be able to take out the Earth for here, though. We're going to be able to get after this one. Zygarde's just, just absolutely going through people. G-Max Inteleon, looking all spiffy. Gets on his sniper tower. That thing is so cool. I love how he just stands on a tower with a water gun. Look at him. He's got the little scope on top. He's buzzing. He might, he might try to set the geyser. He's probably going to go for a geyser here. But yeah, there goes the draining kiss. That's doing a heaping amount of damage on the Earth too. Keeping him out. Give me some HP back as well. And we are going to lose some. Oh, this thing is Rocky Helmet? Yes, Hydro Slime me. Yes, do that. Please, thank you. Take me down below half. Yes. Yes. All right, you're dead. You're dead. This is a game. This is a game. This one. All right, we are going to get the show it off, but like we didn't really get the setup with it. We're just sweeping with Zygarde here. We're just sweeping with him here. Yeah, there's a Rocky Helmet. A little weird. So special defense boost is coming out here. We are below half. So you guys are going to see this thing growing. Our construct, baby. We getting after it. We getting after it. Yo, this thing's an absolute warrior. This thing's an absolute warrior. Gets an HP boost. Look at that max HP. 630? And we could. Like, if this was a, like, a real match, I'm healing up all day. With this thing, which I'm going to actually do now. I'll heal up. He should be able to eat. He's plus two on special defense. Look at this thing. Absolute beast. So I'm just gonna go for an, an outrage because that's a stab. And I am just gonna floral healing up on him. Make sure this thing's just full on HP. 315 HP non Dynamax. Bruh. Bruh. That's like more than Pokemon that are Dynamax. <laughs> you might have more HP than this Italian. Floral healing. Puts it almost back to full, right? Or too full. Oh my lord. This combo is insane. Hydro Snipes coming out here. It's easy ease, baby. Oh, going after my Comfy. Confi's still eating because we got that special defense boost. Outrage coming through. This thing's broken. This thing's broken. Weakness policy and power construct. It's just GG. OP Zygarde sweeping matches left and right. Final battle coming at you guys. Looking for that perfect record for the Jeans Online Game of Community, baby. Looking for it for you guys. Trying to get Series 8 team started off strong. We're 2-0. Oh, one with a quit. We would have won that game regardless. Our Zygarde was about to get set up. And then we swept in battle number 2 with the Zygarde. Absolutely dominated. This guy is a Sun Gola team. And it has that, like, the Ultra Sun one. I didn't play Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon. I just know that they get, like, the different look or stronger abilities in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. But we're going to go Zygarde to Confi again. Let's get rolling with that. He has some goal. That's kind of scary. Um, he also has Entei. He has that, uh... He has the Tapu Fini and the Dragapult. I kind of want to go Urshifu. Urshifu seems like he's decent here. He has the dark moves. And I kind of want to go Robum just for coverage on that Tapu Fini. 
cover that thing. I think we're thriving with this. I think we're gonna get buzzing. And yo, dude, if he plays Zapdos, I get a thousand arrows that thing. I can thousand arrows that thing. But something else I feel like this uh, Zygarde needs would be a, a Tailwind or like a Speed Boost, something along those lines. Because Speed's like mediocre. But I feel like if you can get this thing in Tailwind as well, that would be phenomenal. Entei and Necromosa, that's what it is. Necrozma. I forgot what it was called. He's gonna go Entei and Necrozma. And Necrozma's kind of scaring me. Uh, what typing is that thing? Is that Fire and Steel? I think, I think it might be. Let me. I can check it out. Necrozma, baby. Psychic and Steel. Okay. Sidekick and steal. Uh, we're gonna drain kiss. We get after us. I am going to get after us. I am going to quake over onto the Necrozma slot. I want that thing out of here. I want it. I want it. I want it out of here. Not to go home. We get after it, yo, dude. Zygarde's ready to pop. He's ready to pop off. We're gonna proc our own policy here. I don't think he can really do much about it. Is he gonna Dynamax? I don't. I don't know. I don't know the. I don't know the speeds of Necrozma. I don't know the speeds of Necrozma. You, know, you never see that thing. I'm loving this is this was a good Pokemon to start off series series eight with or series eight teams with. He's gonna die next. But we do outspeed it. Hopefully it's a Necrozma. I'm hoping it's a Necrozma because we got Stab Max Quake coming at you with weakness policy prop. It is. That's beautiful. So we do outspeed it. That's great. This thing's such a cool looking Pokemon. I love it. I love this Pokemon. Necrozma? It looks so dope. It looks so dope. Here goes my draining kiss. Mwah. This thing gonna be policied as well. Mwah, give me my policy, baby. Plus two my attack board. We are gonna go plus one on special uh, defense, and I believe both these Pokemon might be special defense Pokemon. Two speed's gonna come through. Oh, you can go after my copy now all day. I don't mind it. Next way coming out here. Getting my special defense boost. This thing's eating though. This thing is eating though. On a stab, max quake plus two. That thing eats. And the Crossman eats. I wonder what its HP's at. It's gotta be high. It's gotta be real high. Ooh. I don't like that one bit. Uh, this thing is also policy. What are you gonna go for? He's gonna go for a steel spike. Yes, yo, but Beery Berry clutching it up and he's going after him. I'm probably gonna ally switch this next turn. I probably am gonna ally switch. But Beery Berry still doesn't do nothing. Alright, never mind. But Beery Berry not clutching up. But we got what we wanted to do done. We outspeed the Necrozma. So I don't know if I I can't take it out right now. Unless I double I double into it, which I probably am going to do. I want to, but at the same time, I don't want to. I go really. I don't want to go. I'm gonna go you. It's a defense boost. I do not like. Since I don't like it one bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We go for a wicked blow. Which I think I'm gonna do that. I might just worm one. Go where I think he's attack and get some damage done on the side, just in case he guards, right? Just in case he guards. Don't withdraw anything. Do not go into a fairy type. No way you read that. There's no way you read that. There's no way you read that. I don't like this game. Go after my go after my Urshfu. There's no, not a chance you read that. He's gonna steal spike on the Urshfu. We are Sash. There's no way you read that. No way you read that. This game's crazy. This game's crazy. I can't go for a steal spike next turn and take out the Corfairy. This dude really read that. That's nutty. All right, cool. That's fine by me. I'm gonna try to wake a blow over onto you because I know Steel Spike should be able to take him out. Bro, there's no way he read that. There's no way he read that. That's nuts. Dang, dude, I really want that worm win. I really want that worm win to do damage on that anti slot. Follow um, me, gonna come out here. That's fair. That is a fair move. Clefairy's gonna go down here. And uh, who are you gonna go after? That's my question. I don't think he's trying to. Uh, I think he knows I have power construct. I think he knows I'm rocking it. So he doesn't want me to proc it. I think he knows I have it. You guys are crit. I am gonna get a defense boost, which is huge. So hopefully you go away from my boy here. He still has uh, Entei in the back as his final mod. Wait, no, he still has one other mod. That's pretty nice. This is a solid battle. There you go. We get that defense boost, which I really, really, really like. Dynamax turns are done. Dynamax turns are all over. Actually, he has one, one shot here, and he's gonna go for a steel spike over onto Zygarde. All right, go half. Oh, we did not go half though. Dang, dude, I would have rather went half while we were Dynamax. Defense is boosted. Uh, so a Wicked Blow will take that out. They will neglect all the stat changes. So I'm fine with that. Anthony's gonna come through here. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna be able to drop a thousand arrows. Ooh, baby. Ooh, Jeans is looking good here. 
I don't think we're going to be able to power construct this game, but I, I still think we're going to get the win. We outspeed both. This thing is at extreme speed. This thing is at extreme speed. Uh, I'm just going to go for a sucker punch over on you. Because you know he's going to extreme speed me. Instead of going for that wicked blow, he's going to extreme speed me. So I still feel like we should be able to take out here. With a sucker punch. I know I know he's plus three on defense. I know he's plus three on defense. And I understand that. But I still think a sucker punch and a thousand arrows does take it out. Yeah, okay, so we should be good. Because he should be extreme speed. He goes for a bulldoze. And he almost takes out his neck curve. I, I thought he was going for an extreme speed. He's going to slow us all down. That's fine. That's fine. A thousand arrows should be able to pick up the double KO. And I love the way his move looks. Ready? Let's get after it. Yes, sir. Yo, check this out. Get him out of here, baby. Yo, dude, Zygarde, too good, man. Too good. We get a crit on Necrozma, even though we didn't need it. I think it was on 1 HP. Dumped on the Entei. And now we can just bring out uh, Robin. That's GG's. That is GG's. Who's his final mod? Power oh, Power Construct coming out. Ooh. Ooh, this dude's scared. This dude is scared. Yo, we get HP back to dude. This team is so good. Yo, you guys definitely gotta try it out. You guys definitely gotta use it. I feel like this is easy Master Ball battles. Or easy Master Ball tier with this team. Or a Zygarde team in general. Because this is a good Zygarde team, but definitely there's going to be better ones once people start learning it more and more. But yo, Adam's back definitely rocked out with this one. And he's going to go in with you. That's totally fine by me. That's totally fine by me. Grace Surge is going to pop. Uh, do I? I cannot fake this thing. Bruh. Should hold up. We might lose this one. We might lose this one. In that case, I am going to Grace God. I am going to Protect. I am going to protect because he is going to go for like a dragon arch or something, right? I do not just want my Zygarde to go down. I'm going to protect here, see what he does. Grace guy's going to come out. Uh, try, try to do some damage to this thing. Not very effective, but still doing some damage. Dragon arch is going to come out here. And Robin eats up. Oh, did a lot of damage. Critical hit, that's why. Yo, you biscuit. And they double through, that's whack. He's going to take some life or damage. Grace guy should be able to. So he really gets a crit there. We should be able to eat up one dragon art, right? There's no way one dragon art is doing over 230 or 228. So I gotta get after you. I gotta outreach her. Come on, baby. Grace guy coming out here. Nope. No, dragon darts. Do not take out Zygarde. Zygarde, eat. Let's taste the second out there. Oh my god, he, he eats that up like a tank. He eats that up like a tank, yo. Like a tank. This thing's amazing. This thing's amazing. We're gonna outrage for, for victory. For victory. Get him. Get him out of here. Get him out of here, yo. Dude, this thing is so good. It is so good. One, one of the best teams I ever used. This thing, you just set up with him, and it's just so easy. You set up, and you just sweep. See that code at the bottom of the screen? Write it down. Put it away somewhere, rent it, use this team for the Series 8. I promise you guys you won't regret it. This team is so good and easy to play. You could probably get Master Ball tier with it very, very easily. You just set up with Zygarde and you go from there. But I feel like Series 8 is going to be tons of fun considering they did it perfectly. Only one restricted Pokemon per team, so it doesn't make it too OP, but it adds a little bit of zest and brings the fun back into this game considering we're getting some new Pokemons. But shout out to my boy Azback for dropping this team. Seriously, this team is fire. I really do love it. I cannot wait to use it more and more once rank comes out. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. Seriously, subscribe if you want to stay up to date with all things Series 8. We're going to be trying to show off all the restricted Pokemons on their own teams and getting wrong with that. But thank you guys so much for the support. Seriously, you guys rock out. Make sure you guys spread some positivity today, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.